Will the Easter Beagle stop by? Will the Great Pumpkin show up? Or will Charlie Brown still get a little tree? You gotta check it out. Garden City Production doing the latest version of You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown. The musical is actually very similar to the comics themselves. Um, a lot of the scenes are actually derived from the comics. So it's a bunch of vignettes rather than like one story line like most musicals are. In the cartoons actually, there's uh, they've pulled a lot of the music from that. So uh, there's a lot of music that people will recognize in the show. And tell me about some of the actors that are uh, taking part in this production. Uh, we have a couple who are new to GCP, which is really great. It's always nice to see some new faces. But uh, I've worked with a few in the past, our Snoopy. I've worked with Brian a few times. And so it's nice to work with some people you, I've, I'm used to, but also some really awesome new talent. Now the cast is complete, so you're not looking for a teacher because wah, 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 I could do <laughs> Well, hey, we might need you if our, we, we have a, an appearance of that, yeah. <laughs> Tell me what it's like being basically the big star of Peanuts, Charlie Brown. Well, it's just it's just so much fun. I get to work with a bunch of amazing people, and it's fun seeing everything come together and just singing. It's it's just a lot of fun. How do you approach something like this? You know, like a cartoon person or someone off of a newspaper to put your own spin on it and make them come to life? Well, Charlie Brown he's an optimist, but he can also be pessimistic. He it's hard to tell exactly what he's doing, so you have to take it scene by scene. Every decision he makes has to, it, it's always spot on, like he always has to do something. He doesn't always succeed at what he does, but bringing something into a cartoon, you get a good idea of what they want from you. I'd seen you years ago playing Daddy Warbucks. How much different is this to be Snoopy? <laughs> how much different? This is the hardest role I've ever had to prepare for because how do you prepare for an animated character? A dog that doesn't speak, but yet he has lines and a couple of songs. So Snoopy actually speaks in the... He actually does. Lots of... It's just like the comic strip. So as opposed to a bubble or whatever they call that in the comic strip, it's actual dialogue. And a lot of it's lifted right out of the comics. It's rather funny actually, but very difficult to, to get your stage business and what you want to do. Now, is it a little difficult, you're talking to some of the others, to take the character from being, you know, a drawing or a cartoon to being real life? Well, I think maybe for some of the other characters, but Lucy, it's a very solid character. Um, she's, it's easy to uh, interpret what she's doing on, in the cartoon and in the comics, and uh, it's a lot of fun to bring it to life. So, no, I'm not finding it hard at all. I, uh, not that I was typecast or anything, but uh, I'm enjoying being a little sassy. Now tell us a little bit about the run that will be here at Ridley College. Um, so we run for three weeks. Um, and it's a really great show for families and, and kids are very welcome to come along. So if it's a kid's first time seeing a show, this is a perfect opportunity to bring them out. You're a Good Man Charlie Brown runs Fridays, Saturdays and Sundays right through till April the 2nd. To find out more about tickets, log on to their website gcp.ca. Reporting for The Source, I'm Bob, wah, 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 Romeo.